Alrighty. I'm used to music being in the background for title screen, so this is actually a little awkward. Um, welcome to Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. Hey guys, I said that backwards, so fuck me, alright? Sekiro is a new game that came out about two days ago, maybe. Um, and it's made by the same people who made Dark Souls. And funny note, I was actually going to start uploading Dark Souls today because I got back into it. And then I heard about this game, I'm like, I need to play this, it looks badass. <laughs> because uh, from what I've seen, it's ninjas. It is Dark Souls mechanics with a little bit of more cool stuff. And it has a story. <laughs> Dark Souls has a story, don't get me wrong. But this one has a story that is focused on rather than just you can look into it if you want. So that's got my attention straight away. So Dark Souls will be resuming right after this. But I'm more interested in this game at the moment. So from what I heard about this game, this game follows uh, a vengeance story from what I've looked up. Um, I haven't. I tried to stay blind to this as much as possible, but I've looked up a few things just to find out what it's about. I'm not sure what vengeance it's about. I'm not sure if someone died and they're after the killer. I'm not sure if they lost their role, like in Dishonored. Uh, all I know is it's, it's a vengeance story. Um, but the mechanics of the game are pretty cool, and we'll experience them together. So without further ado. I I want to get into this. I want to get into this. So, new game. Alright, so... Camera speed, everything, cool. Yes. Save settings. So there's no difficulty. No difficulty. Got it. Now I am playing in window... Oh, cool. In the closing years of the Sengoku era, Japan was consumed by a perpetual conflict. The fires of war raged on, spreading deep into the mountains, to the land of Ashima. Summarize. Oh. Oh God. Yes. Blood everywhere. Take out the bigger man. Is no more. Ashina staged a bloody coup and wrested control of the land. Isa Ashina. What's the matter, Stray? Nothing left to lose. That's a sharp sword. Well, would you look at that? Fascinating. Will you join me, Starving Wolf? On that day, a young cub was taken from the battlefield. He trained relentlessly, and indeed, went on to become a master shinobi. In the world of Naruto. You must never forget the Shinobi Code. Hmm. As your father, my word is absolute. Your master's is a close second. As of today, he is your master. Defend him with your life. If he is taken, bring him back at any cost. You understand me, don't you, Wolf? You didn't speak me in a talk, only train. But yes, I understand. Oh. 
Alright, so that was a cool opening scene. So it looked like there was a girl at first, and then he grew up and he looks like a boy. Is it a boy or a girl? I'm gonna assume boy. Some twenty years after Ishin's coup, the Ashina clan was on the brink of collapse. Ishin, okay. And the shinobi, known as Wolf, had lost everything. Both the man who took him in, and the boy he had sworn to protect. Ooh, snow. Is this us? Or is this the person we have to protect? Shinobi. Open your eyes. For the sake of your master. Uh, just five more minutes, please. Is this the tutorial? Go pick up a bloody lost item? I mean, I know it's probably a request or something, but that's what I'm calling it. A lost item. Ooh, nice. Okay, equipment menu, quick items. The equipment menu allows you to change your currently equipped quick items. <sighs> there are five slots available to equip and switch out quick items needed. Okay, home of doll. Items currently in possession can be viewed through the inventory. Um, a small palm-sized wooden Buddha can be used repeatedly. Held by the wolf ever since he was saved by his father. It corners are rounded with use. This Buddha is used to return home. It will return the user to the last visited sculptor's idol or the dilapidated temple. Oh! Oh, that's cool! Because in Dark Souls, you can, like, go back to the bonfire using the spell Homeward, but it takes a while to get the spell Homeward. And this is settings. Okay, upgrade materials, key items. Okay. To the next skill point is 500, so that's experience. And 0 out of 15, I'm not sure what that is. And this seems to be... What would this be? I don't know. So, um, I want to have a look at the controls just to get an idea. So, moving around is obvious. Step dodge and hold to sprint is shift. Jump is space. Crouch is Q. I'm going to change this to C. Actually. Oh, you're kidding me. I can't change it to my um, extra mouse buttons. That's stupid in my opinion. Alt then. Slow movement speed. What would be the point of slow movement speed? Slow movement shift. Oh, hang on. There, now, there it is. Okay. <laughs> There's a different area for mouse and a different area for keyboard. Camera controls, move the camera around, and then camera reset is on um, middle mouse button. Hmm. <coughs> Still. Cycle quick items. And then cycle quick items in reverse. I would rather this being, um, this being this. Cycle prosthetic tool. What's a prosthetic tool? And then attacking. Use prosthetic tool. Grappling hook. Grappling hook! Gravity falls. Um, action. Okay, that's E. Use items R. Eavesdropping. Oh, this is going to turn into Assassin's Creed. I um, might change this to... 
I'll actually leave it as um. Okay, I think I'm good. Sorry that took a while. So, um. So I guess we can't run right now. Okay. Ornamental letter. A letter thrown into a well. Cure is wolf. Your destiny awaits you at the Moonview Tower. Escape from the well and find the tower bathed in moonlight. Even without a blade, you can reach it. Stay silent, stay vigilant. Okay, this game's gonna teach me how to stealth, I'm guessing. That's fine. Okay, space. Oh. Oh, wall jumping. That's gonna come in handy. Oh, I think I'm in trouble. If I'm in water too long, can I die? Really? That's interesting. Holy shit, what is with my hair? Is that because of the water? Or is that just how he looks? That's, uh, that's crazy. Okay, I'm a little annoyed with these mo moving controls, because when I'm walking forward, and then if I press, like, left or right while I'm in the middle of it, it, like, it stops my movement slightly. <laughs> okay, Ashina Reservoir. By the way, Manola, guess why this game's gonna be hilarious for Nico to play? Because he always mispronounces uh, Asahina as Ashina. Okay, so that's my crouch button. Um... Okay, so the girl came up to this. What's this? Hey, door. Uh, yeah, that is definitely going to be able to hold it shut, just a rope. Wall hug. Okay. And no matter what I do, unless I press E, I won't fall off. This is the kind of wall hugging I like. Uh, WASD while hugging the wall to peek. Oh, this is cool. Advance without being seen by crouching in bushes or moving under floors. You do not have a sword at the moment. Use stealth to avoid enemies and head to the Moon View Tower. If you're about to be seen, warning markers appear above enemies' heads. That shinobi at the bottom of the well. We didn't shackle him, restrain him, nothing. That doesn't worry anybody? Not at all. Not only is he unarmed, he has completely lost his will to live. Nothing but a coward. <laughs> I just wanted to test that out, sorry. Hey! <laughs> that was fast. DEATH! <laughs> I wanted to see how fast they could notice me. Quick items. Okay. Safety roll. While drowned, while downed or poster broken, shift. Oh, I'm back here. Got it. So I'm used to, um, I'm used to walking while looking around. It's going to be very hard in this game because of the fact of when I'm walking and then I'm pressing left or right, it messes with my camera angle. So a lot of my looking around will probably just be while crouched. Okay. 
Doesn't seem to happen when I'm cram when I'm crouched though. Wolf can slip in the tight spaces, such as beneath floors, when crouched. That's good. Eavesdrop. The moonlight shines strongly on the Moonview Tower tonight. The Divine Heir is probably using the light for his reading again. Probably, but imprisoning a mere child. I feel sorry for the boy. Agreed. But I'm sure Lord Genichiro has his reasons. Yeah, reasons like, oh, fuck that boy, I'm gonna ruin his life for good. So something happened to our clan, the Ashina clan. And as our job, we got to imprisoned and for some reason we weren't tied up I'm wondering why but I'm assuming the person we were made to protect the clan leader or something the moon you took. he um it's hang on it's locked, right? mm, it's certainly locked but <laughs> nobody picked that hole in the wall oh don't worry about it the whole face is the edge of a cliff. No one could pass through it. Uh, you may want to check that again. Um, I'm guessing we are going to go save that guy. My only question so far is who's the girl? Obviously we're at the start of the game so we don't have these answers. And why weren't we tied up? And more, like, important question, why the fuck was it so easy to get out? Makes me wonder if the person who put us in there wanted us to get out. Oh. Shimmy, 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 shimmy. Oh, shimmy. There we go. Uh, eat, climb up. Jump! Oh, the jumping in this game is so much better than Dark Souls. I jumped like a superhero. Oh, and we can grab onto ledges while in the middle of jumping. That's wonderful. Oh. It's gonna get a lot of, um, getting used to, though. Having to remember. Oh, I need to press E to climb up. Okay, here I am. Oh, hi. Who are you? That anti-gravity hair. To come here. Was that the girl, or something? It's been too long, Wolf. Hmm. I've come to free you. Oh, my lord. Oh. Well then. Already getting plot twisted. This is the fucking girl they got saved in the middle of that fight. I thought we were the same Where person. Kusabi Maru. Kusabi Maru. Your sword. Kusabi? Kusabi Kun. My shinobi. In accordance with the bond of Lord and Retainer, you will pledge your life in my service. As you command. I really like the art style for this game. I just thought I'd say that. Oh! Kusabi Moru! A katana, a katana given by Kuro, the divine heir. An heirloom of the Harata family. A cadet branch descended from Ashina. Once thought lost, it has found its way back into the hands of the wolf. The name Kusabimoru, um, Kusabi Moru beseeches a shinobi's role is to kill. That even a shinobi must not forget mercy. A mantra the blade itself may manifest. Oh, that's cool. Hey. So yeah, this is the girl we um that the old the, the guy saved and cut her cheek as well. Is the wound still there? Um 
I think it is. I think I see it. Slightly. Yeah, I, I, I think I see it. It's just down her eye, like there's a black streak. It looks like hair, but I think that's the cut. So yeah, I thought that this girl was actually us, and that she grew up, and it turns out it was actually a boy. Just looks like a girl. But no, she, she's the heir. I didn't expect that. Um... Wolf. Wolf. I do have one more thing to give you. Yeah, uh, out there's trouble as well. I'm gonna... So it seems like it makes it obvious what I can check and what I can't, so... I'm not gonna go around checking everything. Whoa. Was that physics? There's physics! <laughs> There's physics! <laughs> There's fucking physics! Yeah, wreck all the books! Rawr! Destroy all the books, send them overboard! Boom! What? Hug wall. Oh, sorry. That reminds me of uh oh, what says pellet medic mis medical medicine pellets that slowly restore vitality. A secret treatment passed down for generations in these lands. Records say it has been used in battle since times long gone, and lent to the famed resilience of Ashina warriors. A pill case full of these pellets would also serve as a battle charm. Okay, so it heals me. It's cool. Can I take that? That looks like it'd be awesome to wear. Uh, in Splatoon 2, I recently got a hat that looks like that, and yeah, it looks weird. But yeah. I expected these to be a little important, by the way. They look like chests. But I guess they're not. Just try the box! <laughs> okay. I wonder if there's fall damage. Let me check that out. Doesn't seem like it. Also, we're gonna have a bit of a problem if... The, this does that. It's better than the camera purposely pushing forward to be in front of it, but still. It is a special gourd of medicinal waters. Use it to heal your wounds. Pellets? Oh, healing gourd. A gourd filled with vitality restoring medicine. Res um, rest resting refills the gourd. Made by an apprentice of the extraordinary doctor, Dogen. Though it is strange that the guard's medicinal waters refill automatically, the seeds without, within may hold the secret to how it works. My so it's, it's basically now the then, healing flask. Are you gravely injured? A afterward? After what? Do you not remember that night? I do not. Yeah, sadly. No. We'll talk about it later. Foreshadowing. Now we must escape Ashina Castle. As you say. There's a secret passage beneath the moat bridge that will take us out of the castle. Lord Ishin told me about it once. I ask you to find that secret passage. Once you find it, hmm, signal me with a reed whistle. You know, like you used to long ago. I will join you as soon as I hear it. What are we doing? P pulling a Legend of Zelda? Uh, you can cycle through various quick items and use each according to the situation. For instance, if you have taken damage, you can recover vitality with the healing gourd. I'll uh, use quick item and yeah, okay. So, let me just put on pellet. Uh, do this. Okay. Cool. There's a secret passage beneath the moat bridge that can take us out of the castle. Find the secret passage beneath the moat bridge so that we may escape Ashina Castle. When you've reached it, give the signal. I'll come as soon as I hear the reed whistle. Yes, my lord. The fact we're calling her lord, does that mean she's actually a guy? Or is lord just the term you always give girls and guys? Posture and death blows. A shinobi aims to break an opponent's posture. Attacking an enemy is one way to achieve this. When an enemy posture breaks, he is vulnerable to shinobi death blow. Attack and after breaking posture, death blow is an attack. Charge! 
BOOM! <laughs> Doom boom boom! Yes! <laughs> Deflection. Sometimes relentless attack is not enough to break an opponent's posture. Deflecting enemy attacks is another way to damage their posture. Master Shinobi uses a combination of deflect and attacks to achieve swift victory. Okay, right the moment attack lands. Ow! Oh, death! Relentless! No! Okay, so is it gonna... Ooh, that's a nice picture. Healing Gourd! If you've taken damage... Okay. So... Um... It said the moment it, it lands. Is it gonna be nice? Also, I was about to ask, is it gonna be nice and make it that no one actually respawns? But I guess not. This is why I have sensitivity mouse all the way up. Oh, as far up as I can. So I can turn around first. Okay, where's the guy that was, um... There he is. Hey. Oh, yes! <laughs> oh, baby! <laughs> okay, so this is my health, it seems. Uh, that's pretty nice. You can see it when I attack. I've made it that um, the HUD goes invisible after I'm not using it. So, that's pretty nice. Um, it might get a little annoying because I might want to see my health, but I should be fine. Okay, so I want to go to key config. Uh, what's the lock-on button? Is there a lock-on button? Uh, lock on target. Um, camera reset, lock on. Okay. I'm going to have to test that out. Let me uh, clear some space on my desk for a second. Just so I can move my mouse a lot more. Cool. Lock on. By locking onto your target and keeping your enemy in front of you, you'll find it much easier to attack. Deflect and perform other odd combat actions. Lock on release target, and while locked on, change target. Hey, man. Oh, God. Okay. Boom! I don't seem to take damage while I do that either. Oh, yeah! I'm going to have so much fun with this. Obviously, it's going to get a lot harder. Okay, I might change my settings down just a little bit, because... Shit. Keep that on max. I might turn off SSAR medium. Depth of field? I don't really like depth of field. It it blurs around it blurs out a lot of the outer edges. And I don't like that. Motion blur is also something I really hate. Hate with a passion, but I still hate. Okay, I think I should be good with everything else. Hey. <laughs> yes. Now I wonder if this will go down the Dark Souls path. So the body should stay that cool. Um, I wonder if this will go down the Dark Souls path where demons and shit, like demonic things, will come in. Or will it just be humans, like other shinobi? Because it could be, like, a lot of ninja stories involved uh, cursed spirits and stuff. And I, at least that's what I remember. And I'm wondering if they'll go down that path. Hey. See, um, uh, as you, I th I'm not sure if they explained it yet, but from one thing I found out while researching this game a little bit, is they have two health bars. One is vitality, which is normal health, and one of them is posture. And so, posture is used every time I block. And if posture goes all the way down, then, um, I can't, um, I can't block, and I'm more open to a, um, a finisher. Same with my enemy. 
Okay, Counter Slash. Counter Slash can be performed immediately after deflecting an attack. This allows you to deal post damage without giving the enemy time to recover. Okay, right at the moment the attack lands and left after deflecting Counter Slash. So I've already been doing that. Hey. Boom! Heal, heal, heal. Um, quick item. How do I use it again? Oh. Okay. Boom! Death blurb. I'm running. Go away. Okay, I can tell how this game might get a little hard. Pellet. Medicinal pellet. Oh, I've already read that. What's that center bar, though, I wonder? Is that my posture? Ah, shit. Oh, thank god, that doesn't mean automatic death. Um... Okay, I am on a little bit of health, though. What's this? Fistful of ash. Ash gripped into a hardened clump. Throw it in an enemy to temporarily distract them. In Ashina, the snow falls thick, and thus the hearth runs thick with ash. Okay, so is that uh, the bridge? Whatever bridge they're talking about? Hi. What is with this statue? It looks creepy as fuck. It's not open from this side. Okay. Ah! No! No! Ugh. I just... I just wanted to run. Oh! Oh, thank god. Oh, thank god it has... It has checkpoints. Oh, you... Oh, merciful game. Oh. Okay. Uh, shift, drop down. Um, yeah, okay. So, is there anyone around here? So, I'm assuming I have to drop down here. Appears to be a escape route. Call the divine air with a reed whistle? Not yet. 
want to have a look down here, but I'm not sure if I should go down. Okay, guess it's safe. Oh, hi. What the fuck? It's an evil toad! What the fuck? So, it's not demons, but just the wildlife. Still evil enough for me. Oh, that's overkill for a little creature. I'd say I'm sorry, but I'm actually not. Okay, so... Am I meant to go all the way back up? Is that why this is here? Oh, god damn it. I can't, like, hold onto the ledge of this. Which is hilarious as fuck. Okay. Wait, what was that? I... Oh, okay. If, um... If I press space while in the middle of jumping and I'm not against a wall, it does a big jump. That's cool. Oh, uh, shit. I'm back down now. Oh god damn it. I'm being greedy. I'm underestimating um, how this game is. I'm underestimating all its mechanics, I'm underestimating and I'm underestimating how fluent the mechanics feel. How everything just feels like I can do whatever the fuck I want and not get any punishment. And I'm getting punishment because I'm thinking that. It's like right here I thought I could jump and land on the other end, but nope. Now, areas like this, I can do that. Jeez, I'm strong. Okay, it's cooler. Let us leave this place. Yes, my lord. To think that this is the only way to run from the faded bloodline is the only answer. Okay. Where shall we go once we're away from the castle? I suppose the first thing we should do is cross the Ashina border. Or perhaps we should hide somewhere. What do you think? Whatever you desire. Whatever I desire? That's the wolf I know. That's the wolf I love controlling. I was just reminiscing. Onward then. Okay. He didn't bow while talking to her that time. Maybe it's not a constant thing. Ooh. 
Ooh, this looks pretty. Whoa, did that just phase into existence? That was weird. The divine air. Last we stood together was your uncle's funeral. Lord Genichiro. Oh. I. Do you want some kusabi maru? Thank you. Leave this to me. I see it doesn't have time for words. So the noble shinobi stands in our way. It's alright, man. You don't have to fight me. Maybe it's too late. Is it going to be a fight or is it going to be a cut? Yeah, it's going to be a fight. Cool. You face Kenichiro Asuna. Yeah, goddamn. Oh, I'm, I'm losing my controls. I'm sorry. I can't tell when his attack is gonna land. Fuck! Wait, was I meant to lose that? Whoa, what the hell? Oh, it was a scripted fight! Well, not scripted, I could have won, I think. I didn't see his health bar though, maybe it wasn't dropping down. Is that all the shinobi has to offer? I've seen the artwork! I get a robot hand! The divine heir will be coming with me. Are you kidding me? Yeah, we're gonna go save her now. It's the shinobi's job to do that, after all. No, my lord! If it gives me like a game over thing, I'm just gonna pull bullshit. <laughs> Something makes me want to just go back now and try beating him. <laughs> 